So let's just settle into our meditation posture and check your feet. If you are sitting at a desk with your legs down, make sure they're parallel and knees are parallel and that your um, ankles are not kind of crossed. So have them everything parallel and the shoulders are over the hips. If you are sitting in the regular cross-legged position, you can have something underneath your knees to support you and definitely make sure your sits bones are raised. Two to four inches is good. Align your shoulders with your hips and imagine your spine is a string of pearls of light stretching from the base all the way up through the crown of the head. And you can imagine someone is behind you very gently lengthening your spine. So just put some space in between those vertebrae. The head is slightly tipped forward, the eyes are down looking along the length of the nose. Welcome Andrew. And if your eyes were open, they would be looking at a spot about two inches ahead of you on the ground. Tip of the tongue is on the roof of the mouth and relax the jaw. Lips can be slightly apart. Let's just draw our attention to the crown of the head and relax the scalp, the forehead, the eyes, the back of the eyes, the nose, the cheeks, the area around the mouth. Bring your attention to the back of your head and relax the scalp, particularly the occipital bone area. And relax the ears, the inner ear, the temples, the jaw, the back of the tongue. And relax and just release any tension in the back of the neck and the shoulders. Just let them drop down. You can, if you want, you can just shrug your shoulders up. Just drop, let them drop. And just imagine your shoulder blades are dropping down. So you can imagine you're putting your angel wings into their pockets. And just uh, try and get, notice if there's any sensation in the upper thoracic area in your back. And just try and release that. And relax the throat, the chest, the belly, the limbs, hands, fingers, feet and toes and bring the mind to the breath. Noticing the sensation of the air as you're inhaling and exhaling, it's flowing in across the nostrils. If there are any sounds in your environment, whether it be in your home or outside your home, Just uh, allow them to be there. Try not to engage. And the same with your thoughts. Try and put some space in between your thoughts. Actually doing that does help you dis disengage. To not get caught up in a story. or Also try not to criticize your self. Your thoughts. And again... Imagine you're sitting on the bank of a river, just watching it flow by. Imagine this is a river of your mental moments. You're watching with curiosity, interest, objectivity, and you're free from them while you're sitting on the bank there watching them. So let's just bring to mind all the people of our life. And welcome Manuel and Vanessa. Your loved ones, the 
people with whom you are in functional, constructive relationships, people who you care about, family, friends, spouses, children, your besties, and then they're those people in your life who you have a bit of difficulty with. And then there's the strangers, these people who fleetingly move in and out of our life. I just think they're all deserving of our equal concern. That's the first thing. Why? Because, just like us, they all want to be happy and they don't want to suffer. And they all have this unbelievable capacity for this enlightened mind. I think we'll do this meditation this evening for all these people in our life and by extension all sentient beings and if there's some person people or situation that you know of you can include those in your thoughts so here we are doing this purification practice in the context of the four opponent power so just remembering again there is no negativity that cannot be purified. This purification process is basically a psychological one. We create negativity with our minds. So we're going to counter that by creating positivity with our minds instead. So first of all is the power of regret. So sincerely regret from the depths of your heart anything you've done to harm any living being on this day, in this life in all past lives and you can think of the specific actions of your body and your speech that have been harmful to others maybe also to yourself and this reason to regret is based on this logic of karma and given that everything we experience both good and bad is the result of our past karmic actions if we harm others, we will necessarily experience suffering in the future. So logically, if we don't want to experience suffering in the future, it makes sense to pull out those karmic seeds before they ripen as a future suffering. So think, I regret from the depths of my heart having harmed others with my body and my speech, having broken my vows, because I do not want the future suffering. I'm sick of suffering. And also regret any anger, attachment and the rest that are the cause of why we harm others and think again, I'm sick of this suffering. And then think, what can I do about it? Whom can I turn to? So here you come to the power of reliance. So we rely upon, we turn to the Buddha, the doctor, who has the methods that we can use to purify. And we're not asking Buddha to forgive us. We're, we're wanting to use his methods, his medicine, to heal ourselves. So imagine Vajrasattva is above the crown of your head and you can imagine also this is your teacher, your Lama, your trusted mentor, if you have a teacher. If you don't, you can imagine someone like His Holiness the Dalai Lama, if you've heard him speak. So he's manifesting, this is the mind of that person, it just makes it a little bit more personal, manifesting here for your benefit. He's made of radiant, blissful white light, sitting cross-legged, on a white lotus and a moon cushion. He has this beautiful radiant face. His eyes are long and peaceful and full of love and compassion for you and all the people of your life equally. He doesn't mind at all how it is you've shown up this evening. He just accepts you exactly as you are. He has a sweet red mouth. His hair is black and held up in a top knot. He's wearing a five-pointed crown and jewellery and the celestial silken robes in the royal Indian style scarves. He has an aura of light around his head and around his body. His arms are crossed at his heart, the left underneath the right. The left is holding a bell which represents wisdom. The right is holding a vajra which represents the indestructibility of compassion and their being crossed represents the union of these two which symbolizes enlightenment itself, the development of infinite wisdom and infinite compassion. 
to the Buddha, the Dharma, and the Sangha, I go for refuge until I'm enlightened. By this practice of meditating on Guru Vajra Sattva, may I reach Buddhahood so as to benefit all sentient beings. So there's a little section here on compassion. And in order to develop compassion, we need to rely upon other beings, sentient beings. So in this case, we think about the people that we have harmed. And just develop in your heart a wish for them to be free from suffering. And the same thing for the people who have harmed you, even though it may be a little bit more difficult. But the harm that they've caused you is going to cause them suffering. It will ripen, for sure, a suffering in the future. So you can develop a sense of compassion for them because of that. And so make a strong aspiration to do this practice of purification for the sake of all these beings and think I must purify for their sake. So next we come to the power of the remedy and this is really the medicine doing the practice, the uh, mantra recitation and the visualization. So first this is a purification of the body. So imagine Vajrasattva very compassionately sends powerful white nectar like coming out of a hose or from um, like a strong waterfall like Niagara Falls just pouring into you and it keeps pouring into you your entire body it fills you completely and forces out of your lower orifices all of the harm you've ever done to any living being with your body in the form of inky liquid and this pours out of you and disappears into space as we recite the mantra Om Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Supokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawasiri Mimpiyatsa Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajramame Mitsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Satva A Hom Pe Om Vajrasapha Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapha Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Supokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sa Sava Siddhi Min Piyatsa Sava Kama Sitsa Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sava Tata Gata Vajramami Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hom Pe Om Vajrasafa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasafa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Sipokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sava Siddhi Min Piyatsa Sava Kama Sitsa Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajramami Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hom Pe Om Vajrasafa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasafa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Sipokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Min Piyatsa Sawa Kama Sitsa Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajramami Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hom Pe Om Vajrasafa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasafa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Sipokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Min Piyatsa Sawa Kama Sitsa Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajramami Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hom Pe Om Vajrasafa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasafa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Sipokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Min Piyatsa Sawa Kama Sitsa Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajramami Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hom Pe Om Vajrasafa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasafa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Sipokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Min Piyatsa Sawa Kama Sitsa Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajramami Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hom Pe Om Vajrasafa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasafa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Sipokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Min Piyatsa Sawa Kama Sitsa Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajramami Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hom Pe And so be delighted that all the harm you have ever done to any living being with your body is now completely purified and think there is no way you could do anything other than benefit others now with your body. So the next is a purification of speech and again Guru Vajrasattva very happily sends powerful nectar from his heart chakra and this arcs around and forcefully enters your crown filling your entire body except this time forcing up to the top of your body all the negativity of your speech and this overflows and disappears into space not one atom left so just imagine all the gossip and the harsh speech and the useless speech and lying and talking badly about others behind their backs 
All of this is purified by this powerful nectar filling you. As you recite the mantra. Om Bhajrasafa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasafa Dina Patita Dina Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Supokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuruhum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajramame Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahom Om Vajra Safa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Safa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Supokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahom Pe Om Vajra Safa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Safa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Supokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahom Pe Om Vajra Safa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Safa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Supokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahom Pe Om Vajra Safa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Safa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Supokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahom Pe Om Pei Om Vajra Safa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Safa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Supokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sitsa Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahom Pei Om Vajra Safa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Safa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Supokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Mimpiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahom Pei So again, feel so happy. Just rejoice. Your speech is now completely purified. And imagine it's not possible to do anything other than benefit others now with your speech. So just imagine how amazing that would be, you know, everything that comes out of your mouth is the most appropriate thing for that person in that moment. So just only wisdom, compassion, kindness. How incredible would that be? So the next is a purification of the mind. And Vajrasattva now very compassionately sends powerful beams of light from his heart chakra and this arcs around and enters your crown and fills your entire being. So it's just the same as when you walk into a room, a dark room, and you switch on a light. That light instantly dispels the darkness. So it's the same here. Just the very second the light from Vajrasattva's heart touches your heart, or the darkness of the negativity of your mind. So all your depression and anxiety and anger and bitterness and grudges and unhealthy desire and all your wanting and not feeling enough and disappointments and jealousy all of this instantly dispelled not one atom left as we recite the mantra Om Vajrasafa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasafa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Supokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Mepiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Me Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahom Pei Om Vajra Zafa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Zafa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Supokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Mepiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahom Pei Om Vajra Safa Samaya Manupalaya Vajra Safa Dina Patita Dida Mebowa Sutokaya Mebowa Supokaya Mebowa Anarakta Mebowa Sawa Siddhi Mepiyata Sawa Kama Sita Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajra Mame Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Ahom Pei Om Vajra Safa 
Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasafa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Sapokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sava Siddhi Mepi Yatsa Sava Kama Sitta Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sava Tata Gata Vajra Me Mutsa Vajra Bawa Maha Samaya Sattva Aham Pe Am Vajrasafa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasafa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Sapokaya Meboa Anarakta meboa sawa sidi mempi yatsa sawa kama sitta me sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita dida meboa sutokaya meboa supokaya meboa Anarakta meboa sawa sidi mempi yatsa sawa kama sitta me sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutza vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. Vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita. Dida meboa sutokaya meboa supokaya meboa. Anarakta meboa sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sitta me. Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan. Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutza vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe. So be delighted, really rejoice at all your delusions, which are the source of all of our suffering, all your suffering, and the cause of why we harm others with our body and our speech are totally purified. And think now there is no space in your heart for anything other than love and kindness and forgiveness and wisdom and bliss and compassion. So the next is the purification of the imprints of negativity of the body, speech and mind. So we can do, if you wish, a couple of mantras each for the visualization of the body and of the speech and of the mind. Or you can just imagine light and nectar pouring into you from Vajrasattva's heart, filling you completely and eradicating even the subtlest imprints of negative energy from your mind as you recite the mantra. Om Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta Meboa Sawa Siddhi Mepi Yatsa Sawa Kama Sitta Me Sitam Shriyam Kuru Hum Ha 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 Ho Bhagawan Sawa Tata Gata Vajrama Me Mutsa Vajrabawa Maha Samaya Sattva A Hum Pe Om Vajrasapa Samaya Manupalaya Vajrasapa Dina Patita Dida Meboa Sutokaya Meboa Supokaya Meboa Anarakta meboa sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sitta me sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita dida meboa sutokaya meboa supokaya meboa Anarakta meboa sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sitta me Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe Vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita Dida meboa sutokaya meboa supokaya meboa Anarakta meboa sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sitta me Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe Vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita Dida meboa sutokaya meboa supokaya meboa Anarakta meboa sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sitta me Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe Vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita Dida meboa sutokaya meboa supokaya meboa Anarakta meboa sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sitta me Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe Vajrasafa samaya manupalaya vajrasafa dina patita Dida meboa sutokaya meboa supokaya meboa Anarakta meboa sawa sidi me piyatsa sawa kama sitta me Sitam shriyam kuru hum ha 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 ho bhagawan Sawa tata gata vajrama me mutsa vajrabawa maha samaya sattva a hum pe now feel you are completely purified, not one atom of negativity left in your mind stream. And even the subtlest imprints, subtlest obscurations to omniscience have been removed. So the fourth step is this power of resolve where we decide 
to refrain from harming. But first, I think it's just a really good idea to rejoice in the progress that you're making and the effort that you're making. Because sometimes it can get a little bit disheartening. It's like, oh no, I've been working on this for so long and I keep doing the same thing over and over again. Don't worry, we're human. We have habits. We get tired. We make mistakes. But, you know, the bottom line is everyone's just doing their best. So think of something, you know, whether it's to do with your speech, five seconds, five minutes, overnight while you're sleeping, and just make a decision, I'm going to work on this for the next 24 hours, whether it be for five minutes within that 24 hours. Think how amazing. Pat yourself on the back. Good job. So Vajrasattva he is delighted with us. Wanting to merge with your mind, he melts into white light, absorbs into you through your crown, and think, my guru's body, speech, and mind, Vajrasattva's body, speech, and mind, and my own body, speech, and mind are the same thing. And Lama Yeshi would call that union oneness. It's a very sweet way of using English language. So um, Rinpoche recommends here to meditate on the emptiness of the three circles. In emptiness there is no I, the creator of negative karma. There is no action of creating negative karma. And there is no negative karma created. So place your mind in that emptiness for a little while. And we can think of all phenomena as being empty. They do not exist from their own side. So we just dedicate all the positive energy, all the merit we've created this evening during this purification to all living beings, thinking, may all the virtuous karma I've created from doing this practice ripen as my enlightenment for the sake of sentient beings as quickly as possible. And for His Holiness the Dalai Lama, the wish-granting, wish-fulfilling jewel, source of every single benefit and happiness in this world, to the incomparably kind Tenzin Gyatso, I beseech, may all your holy wishes be spontaneously fulfilled. And for Lama Zepa Rinpoche, For Lama Ursul, Venable One, to use kindness succeeds out of all the conquerors, for those wanderers in far off places, especially the West, mindful of your loving concern for us and intentionally descending again into a family of a far distant land. We make this request, O Lama, please, please live long. And for Geshe Shara, beloved teacher, leading your students toward wisdom and compassion, explaining through exacting discernment the steps of the graduated path, you are the unequal guide. Please live a long and stable life. So there we are, gone like a dream yet again. Go so fast. Thank you, everyone, very much. Thank you, Mary, for hosting. So lovely to see you all. Good night. Sleep well. And I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Thank you. Good night, everyone. Thank you very